My whole life I grew up afraid of water and I have a huge respect for water, which I think makes my diving even more important to me. There is no way to describe what it's like to be weightless, to look at a fish or a shark and be one with them. I think we can forget how fortunate we are to live in Canada and all the freedom it offers. I was born in Serbia and came to Niagara when I was six years old and couldn't speak any English. I settled in Niagara Falls and I have never moved away. It's so easy to get wrapped up in everything that goes on around you and busy lifestyles and everything else. And then all of a sudden, your son gets diagnosed with leukemia. And you quickly learn the benefits of being Canadian and our health system. I know that if I lived in most other countries, I could not have survived that financially, and maybe he wouldn't have been able to survive it at all. And that, to me, is frightening. My son is doing amazing now. We had 25 months of chemo, and that was pretty rough on him, but he learned so much about all the meds and everything that he was taking, and he started cooking for himself healthier things, and he just fell in love with it. He is studying to become a chef. He's been working at Vineland Estates Winery, and can't imagine doing anything other than being a chef. We are all affected by cancer in one way or another, and it's a fight we're all going to have to fight together. So uh, in 2010, as the president of the Niagara Divers Association, myself, Brenda Arndt, and Christine Davidson decided to start Dive for a Cure, and uh, we raised $45,000 towards the Canadian Cancer Society. It's really hard to explain how much I love Canada. I, I have so much opportunity here. I have the opportunity to work. I have the opportunity to have a business, to have a big family. I own my own home. I have so many things that I can't even imagine having if I lived anywhere else in this world.